This vessel contains my daughter Kara Zorel from the now dead planet Krypton. Treat her as you would your own child. She will prove a treasure for your world. Treasure? You're sure of the translation? It says treasure. Not terror, not trouble. Always the cynic. You can't help yourself, can you? You know those tests I was running? Her cellular structure is a shade more dense than yours. She metabolizes sunlight more efficiently. It could be her youth. It could be something else. Bottom line, she might be more powerful than you. It makes me wonder. So does her sudden appearance. I find it just a little too... Camp Lugos! Camp! Speak English. It's attacking! What's attacking? Bad! Crypto! No! Bad dog. Kara's a friend. Leave her alone. I'm sorry. I... I've tried to get him to like me, but he just barks and growls. He hates me. Go up to your quarters. But I didn't do anything wrong. We'll talk later. Crypto's just feeling a little overprotective, aren't you, boy? I don't know. I've always considered him a good judge of character. Look, she's been through a lot. Not to mention learning an entire language in less than a week. Why don't you cut her some slack? We don't know anything about her. She claims to have no memory of anything prior to splashing down in Gotham Bay. I'm not saying there aren't loose ends. Having no control over her powers is more than a loose end. She's dangerous. Which is why she's in quarantine until she can gain control. She may be the only blood relative I have left. I'm willing to give her the benefit of the doubt. At least for the time being. You don't have a problem with that, do you? No problem at all. But I can't speak for the dog. Spying on me now? You don't like me, do you? <laughs> it's you that has the problem. Why can't you just leave me alone? You'll never understand what it's like to be me. Then explain it to me until I do. Does any of this help fill in your memory lapses? Some. I know that's my Uncle Jarrell and my Aunt Lara. Because Superman, Kal-El, told you? No, because I remember. Uncle Jarrell was like my father. They both believed the planet was doomed, which is why my father also built a ship. He told me the navigation system was locked onto Earth and that he and my mother would soon follow. I was just about out when I saw them die right before my eyes. And then there was that light, that awful, blistering light. Then, all I remember is darkness. The rest you told me. How the asteroid carried me across the galaxy until it broke apart and I landed here. Do you remember your mother's name? You know I don't. Why don't you trust me? Kalel has enemies who would go to great lengths to destroy him. You think I would hurt my own cousin? Perhaps not intentionally. I sensed your presence earlier because I thought I heard your heartbeat. I was wrong. You have no heart. 